Hi everybody, Tammy here. Welcome to my channel. I have Elowen, one of my Elowen dolls with me today because we have some mail to open up from her, um, or for her, I should say. It is from uh, Rachel Hoffman. Uh, she is doing a lot of these mix and match um, sets as far as the Elowen dolls are concerned, and Nima, Nima also. Oh, we got a little fruit snackies in here, a little, little some. Something, something for me to munch on. Thank you. And then we have, this is a cool little bag. Huh, neat. She's always very generous with the swag, I gotta say. Of course, you know how the, you know how it goes. You know how the story goes. I hadn't planned on buying anything. Um, I have six, well, I have four Elowen Wilds and two Nima dolls. They have the same bodies. And the last mix, mix and match, I bought quite a few things, so I was all like, I'm not going to get any more. But then she did a video, and Christopher showed some really cool ways to style everything. And, you know, well, I got I got hooked, and I actually didn't get a few things I wanted to get. So, anyway, let me let me just randomly pull something out here. Oh, cool. This is one of the, the skirts. It's a pencil skirt. And, let's see. Houndstooth. Style. I, they had these really cool glasses that were um, included in the styling that he did and I did not get the glasses and I'm kind of bummed so if those glasses come again I'm going to be jumping on those and they were very reasonably priced I think most of her dresses and outfits and mix and match pieces accessories are extremely reasonably priced um, and they're very well made look how cute this is obviously there will be a fashion show at the end um, super cute all right let's see what else is in in the bag oh I didn't order this but she gave me oh free gift oh this is one of those towels I was curious about these oh soft how not oh this is really thick oh my my uh, Malibu might might steal this <laughs> Yeah, my, my uh, Malibu Blythe doll, she would probably like this for her beach trips. That's super nice. Thank you. All right, let's see. We got this super fun. Wild by D by wild subscription by VDC box, launching soon. Okay, so she's going to have a an Elowen Wild subscription box. I'm extremely tempted. I don't remember if these are out or not yet. These tend to, in my opinion, these tend to be a little bit scary for me on the price because it's a subscription. It's not like a one-time purchase. However, I know from previous subscription boxes she's done for the Grace dolls from what I've seen unboxings of, you get a lot for your money. So um, I'm just not sure if I'm ready to commit, you know, on a subscription. Oh, how cute. You know, I almost bought these. They have uh, more of them. I think they had a set of like six or something. And these are super cute. Also would be perfect for Blythe. <laughs> but these little clips. Let me see. Oh, nice. So they're covered. These are well made. So this would really look good. Actually, the outfit she's got on would look cute with this. Oh, wait, hold on. Let me, this way. Whoops. See how that, that kind of matches a little bit. How does the, oh, I guess either way. Okay, oh, we got a little bit of a sneezies going on here. All right, super cute. And there's a yellow and a purple. And this is cute, this little pouch. All right, and then we got a hanger, very handy. I actually have a little, um, uh, what do you call it, wardrobe thing I hang stuff on get wild super cute I do love these Ellen wild dolls and then oh that's right so I, I ordered both of the pencil skirts there were some really nice jackets that went with them and I by the time I decided to take the plunge those were sold out but hopefully I think she said that they will be coming back in stock so so I have to keep an eye on them because when they're back in stock, I definitely want to get one or both jackets to go. So they have a suit. And then this I got to go under it. Whoop. 
upside down. <laughs> That's upside down. So it's it's a bodysuit, lacy bodysuit. How pretty. Look at how finished that is. See, like something like this, you know, I do so for dolls, but, you know, I work full time, etc. I have an Etsy shop. I have it. I'm selling on eBay now. I don't have time to sew for every single doll I have. And I could, I could not make, for, especially for the price, I could not make this, you know, and, and my skills even are probably not up to par, but I thought this would look good with either, either one of these skirts. Yeah, so that's why I got that. And with some other stuff I have and, oh, did she, do I have shoes in here? Oh, I need some shoes. I can't remember did I buy you know I did buy these <laughs> I did buy these I was gonna say now because I remember they were gonna go with this and I have a, sh a top that would I have a top in mind that I think is gonna go with this that I already have and that's why I got these shoes now I'm remembering you know how it is when you're shopping and at the mo moment in time you know you have your reasonings for things and then later on you're like what was I thinking <laughs> well but see you have double buckles these will look really nice with this and the shirt that I'm thinking of. So, so basically because I already have that other shirt and I think I have some shoes that, I, that will go with this. I think if not, I need to buy some, um, a lot of the shoes did sell out too. You know, when she has these sales like this, you know, you kind of have to jump on it. It's not like, it's not crazy. Well, no, it's, you know, it's kind of crazy sometimes. I lie. <laughs> right. So anyway, um, but I think I'm going to have enough for two outfits, uh, with what I have here and the shirt I already have. So, um, let me come back and show you, um, a couple of dolls wearing these super cute outfits. All right. These two beautiful dolls. I have Nima on the right and on the left is Elowen and they're ready to show you their beautiful outfits from the latest mix and match over at Rachel Hoffman's site. And uh, yeah, look how cute they are. Very sophisticated feel here. Really like the look of this. This is one of the reasons why I like these Elowen um, type of dolls, these fashion dolls. When it comes to fashion dolls, this is really more of my style uh, versus dolls that look like little children. Um, I'm not against those dolls at all, but my preference is really for this sort of young woman, um, you know, heading out on the town, career minded, fashion conscious, that kind of thing. Fashion forward, I guess I should say. And so they really fit the aesthetic that I like for fashion dolls in general. Um, so these are the shoes. I had a bit of a bit of a struggle getting these on, not going to lie, because there's two buckles on each of these. And I used my pliers. Um, from a distance, I don't think they look too bad. But yeah, that was, that was kind of a, kind of a, a lot to get those on. And I did not put the stand. I did try to put the stand on Nima and there's a trick that supposedly you put the stand, um, on the, the saddle part on her first and then put the skirt on. But these are so tight. Um, I just didn't feel, I don't know. I was afraid I was going to rip something and she's okay. I can, I can hand, have her stand up like this on my, um, dolly shelf, not a problem. So, and I just hung the little get wild <laughs> keychain here for now. So here are both the skirts. I am looking forward at some point to hopefully getting the jackets that go with these, but I do like the top. So this is a top I got from the last mix and match. I think it looks okay. I mean, what do you think? This is, this is kind of, it's got a, it's not yellow, but it sort of has a yellow tint to it. But I, I don't know. It's like a dark cream, I guess is probably more accurate. And then this is sort of a burgundy and, um, you know, with the houndstooth. So that's why I went with the black bodysuit. This fits her perfectly. Really like this bodysuit. Um, I could see picking up the white one. There's a lot of versatility, I think, with this. And, you know, I can just picture her with the jacket on. But even like this, I think they look pretty darn good. I'm really happy. Oh, and these shoes I had, I don't have any black high heels. So um, I did just purchase the 
um, I can't remember what it's called, but it's basically like, um, I feel like not a goodie bag, but a uh, surprise bag, I guess, of Elowin uh, stuff from Rachel. It was $30. They sold out quickly. They're supposed to have shoes. So I thought, well, let me wait and see what those are before I go buy any more shoes. But uh, these gals could probably use a pair of black shoes. But I think the silver looks pretty good. Yep. Let me know again in the comments what do you guys think. As usual, thanks for stopping by and spending a little dolly time with me and my Elowin and Nima. And have a wonderful dolly day. Bye-bye.